On Saturday, Trump sat down with Fox News' Janine Pirro, hoping she could come up with an explanation. Are you moving so quickly that your communications department cannot keep up with yes. you? Yes. That's true. That's a hard-hitting interview. That's a hard-hitting interview. That's a hard-hitting interview. Are you one, so great at being president that no one knows what the hell is happening? <laughs> she continued. So what do we do about that? We, we don't have press conferences, and we do... You don't mean that. Well, just don't have them. Unless I have them every two weeks and I do myself. Oh, sir. <laughs> Please don't do your own press conferences. Hey, buddy. Don't. Hey, buddy. There are always such fountains of eloquence and bastions of dignity. <laughs> what would we make jokes about the next day? Of course, no press conferences might mean no Sean Spicer, but Trump put that rumor to rest. You know Sean Spicer. Mm -hmm. He is a wonderful human being. He's a nice man. Is he your press secretary today and tomorrow? Is yeah, he, will he, he is, be tomorrow? Sure. He is. He's doing, well, he's doing a good job, but he gets beat up. Will he be there tomorrow? Yeah, well, he's been there from the beginning. Okay, he's firing Sean Spicer. <laughs> that is, he's always been You're here. You're fired. You're fired. He's always been here. Luckily, uh, that time Sean spent in the bushes will come in handy next week when he's working at <laughs> Home Depot. Um, I have something to say here. Donald Trump, if you're watching, first of all, you're a bad president, please resign. Second of all... <laughs> Second, please, please, please don't take Sean Spicer from us. <laughs> Where am I going to get my daily dose of veiled anger and condescension? Sarah Huckabee Sanders is okay, but she doesn't have that certain je ne sais what. <laughs> we got a great show for you.